Hello everybody, I'm Finn Whitrock. I've been a proud card-carrying member of Actors Equity since 2008. I've worked in a numerous off-Broadway theaters. I'm about to go to rehearsal for an off-Broadway production in a few moments. Um, and there's a kind of recurring joke that happens when you're working off-Broadway, you know, uh, something like, well, you know, I'm not doing it for the paycheck, which is funny and true. And there comes a point at which it's more true than funny. And there comes a tipping point, I think, which is starting to happen now with the fair wage on stage movement, which is that the, the enormous amount of output from the artists involved in off-Broadway theater doesn't match what they're receiving. You know, the output doesn't match the input. And there comes a tipping point. And the inevitable result, eventually, in a worst case scenario, is that the very vibrant and fertile community that is off-Broadway theater, which is arguably one of the most alive, cutting-edge places to create theater in this country, the quality is going to dissipate. People are going to leave. You're not going to get the caliber of people that you get because it becomes not worth it at some point. You know, there's only so much you can do purely for the love of it. No one's asking for a, a huge salary bump. No one's doing this for the paycheck still. But there comes a point at which you need to, the money needs to reflect the quality of the work. And so I really hope that uh, this next round of contracts uh, fulfills those goals. And uh, I hope that I can continue to make off-Broadway theater part of my life because I love it uh, almost more than anything else. So thank you. Fair wage on stage. Woo.